I'm Kelly Shutnick and this is my video book review. Today we're looking at Who Not How by Dan Sullivan with Dr. Benjamin Hardy. Although this book is intended more for entrepreneurs and business owners, it's probably relevant for most people. The other day, one of the members of my international reading group was talking about how crazy busy he is at work, how coworkers often reach out to him and he wants to help them, but it just takes up so much of his time. He's not the owner of the business, but he's deeply committed to the work that he does and probably struggles with boundaries. Also, he probably thinks he's the only one who can do the work that he does and he doesn't feel empowered to delegate work to other people. All of that said, the conversation made me think about how often I hear this from people. I'm swamped at work, I have so much to do, I'm working 12 to 15 hours a day. If you find yourself saying these things, you may need a who to help you with your hows. Dr. Benjamin Hardy, who's Dan Sullivan's who for the writing of this book, does an excellent job of telling stories throughout the book that illustrate the point that seeking who's in our life is imperative if we want to grow. Even if you don't own a business and you want to grow personally, you need to be able to spend your time on the things that really matter. In chapter two, the authors provide a worksheet or an impact filter um, that is to be used for thinking through any goal or project you're working on honing in on the vision and determining a who, who can help you. I recommend this book if you're a business owner, entrepreneur, manager, or if you just wanna work on freeing up time in your life by delegating more and building relationships. A couple of quotes I wanna share. One is, you are rewarded in life by the results you produce, not the effort and time you put in. And the other one, my favorite, if you have enough money to solve a problem, you don't have a problem.